retail media in context, right? And everybody wants, you know, are moving towards, let's say, some sense of um, profitability or the business goal objective driven. Retail media really supercharges. Rather than, let's say, buying a particular affinity audience, you're able to really define, this is the kind of audience that I have to go after because as a marketer, this is what I am really uh, focused on driving across. And that really gets fulfilled when we activate it in the programmatic system. The data flows in from the right source. Uh, the data is uh, extremely fidel. You know that the accuracy of the data is really good. And therefore, you're able to activate it across various places to reach the right audience at the right time. Uh, I think retail media is where the data rests, the audience intelligence rests. And I think uh, that's where the attribution rests. Because of all of these reasons, it's becoming a preferred choice uh, for marketeers and media uh, personnels so that they get the right data points to justify the media investments. Uh, and I think that gives a lot of confidence back to the business as well as to the brands, marketeers, agencies for that matter, that what they are doing is directionally correct and how much it is, what it is leading to. Well, let's take a brand like Sivamed. I'm saying relatively still smaller. There is just a huge audience out there. While I can do full funnel from a campaign downwards, awareness and then consideration, equally I have enough audience sitting. Let's say Amazon DSP gives me enough signal. Here are browsers of your brand, of your direct competition. I can directly start, let's say, bottom funnel campaign separately. I can start a consideration campaign separately. So I think, again, for anybody who's practicing, can you go back to fundamentals and say, what category am I operating into? What task do I have? And hence, you know, there is not, it's not either, either or. either or, right? You could today do both. So you're starting a campaign from awareness and okay, now how do I dis take this consumer set because they're very important for me to convert versus say I have enough and more signal to run each campaign separately. You know, most of the expectation is awareness and conver conversion a lot of folks do forget that there is a mid-funnel of consideration which is dwelled upon the most by all of us as consumers before we actually make the final decision on purchase. And, and that is the most critical part that programmatic can play a role into. So, so that, that exactly is the step where I feel a lot of DSPs can contribute, especially Amazon, uh, because of the ability to flow the audience without having to have any leakages. Yeah, I think this is something also we, as a group we just spoke about, right? That because ADSP gives you the ability to do a campaign at, at individual funnel level also. I think what we do not realize that from all the complex signals and purchasing path that each consumer has, there is a lot that happens beyond that on Amazon. And that is why it is important uh, to have parts of it running as your individual campaigns and parts of it also running as a full funnel or at least the top funnel campaigns to make sure you're increasing the pool of addressable audience consistently.